Hello my friends, and welcome back to our continued blind let's play, Jimmy and the Pulsating Mask. My name is the Flatless Bird, this is your Soybeast Gaming Channel, and joining with us is the king of the giant robots, Azappa. I'm here to guide you through all the shiny nooks and spooky crannies of this eight-year-old child. It sounds like quite an adventure, so let's go ahead and continue, shall we? You can check that out. I wouldn't recommend doing it, but you can go check it out. Okay, so do we have a new set yet? Uh, no, because you didn't buy the medieval set. You have the futuristic set, but I don't think you're using it. What does the cheese give? Uh, it's, it helps you stand alone. Because the cheese stands alone. Magic deck. I've got the... I've got the stuff up. Alright. Everything's good. Yeah, it just gives me a little more luck. I lose some magic attack, but luck is good. Luck is good for cry. We can go poke at the, at the dark dungeon. I wouldn't go in there, but you can poke at it. Let's not assume. Okay. Check the side side. Yeah. This one is... A horrible drawing. That. that was lame. Boo! That seemed probably that just makes so I kick it immunity deficiency, which I don't care about. Yeah, I think so, actually. Lars is really, really slow. Yes. He, he is most assuredly always going to go that. Which can be, you know, counted on. You're broke. Oh, you're not broke. Is he always going to be there? No. Rubik will be in a place the first time you pass through it, and then once you move on, he will also move on. Like Timmy also moves on. The world is ever changing. I just wanted to come back to him once I got some more money. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven? How did you come up with that? I have seven of them. 
Oh, okay. I, I thought you were um, reading the dots and dashes. No, I was just counting. Ah. Also, has, uh, Lars has a natural regen. Oh, and does I don't he? think I ever checked his uh, special. I don't think you did. What kind of personality might Lars have? Hmm. Slothful one? Sloth. Uh. Uh, equipment. Of all things, it's actually equipment. Lazy, if you're not changing, you're going to sleep 5% HP regen. Nope. Yep. Yeah. And the first and oldest temple. There, there's, there's nothing to it, it's just old and ancient. Push a rock. The buckler. Well, let's just go both biking and striking. Look at that defense jump. Yeah. All right. Well, if you wanted Lars to be really up on that defense. Set him up on counter stance. With, with, with the hit me. Just, just, just go at it. Go ham. I understand. And, and Pocky, and probably uh, a good sandwich. Oh, right, I'm not ready for this. Oh, I will say, is your body ready for this? What? Do you think you can just run away? No. It doesn't work like that, Jimmy. I'll follow you everywhere. See, I'm smarter than you ever hoped to be, Jimsworth. Take whatever form you want. I've developed strategies to defeat you regardless. Whoa, look at this guy. Yeah, I'm not fully ready for this. I'm fully healed. And... You hear that jam? It's the jam. Pretty great. Yeah. Maggot starving in a dead man's mouth. Eight bit. That was dumb. I'm starting late. Right? Ah, uh, oops. That worked.
Oh, that's not good. Oh, mind control? It kind of works like Grasp. Unfortunately, my clarity thing didn't work. On mind control? Yeah. There, there's an answer for it, though. It, it works kind of like Grasp. that He's, he's immune to alert now, so... The problem is he's about to hit with a super attack. Countering a rampage can mean death for the person who did it. Yeah, I know. But I hope for a return. I don't hope for that. Nope, that's a sham. I mean to do that, dang it. Oh, you meant to do sticky flagum. Yep. Oh, now he is definitely going to go slow. Funny, uh, mom was still faster. Right? Almost there. Nice. You lose. There we go. I'll get level twenty five, lowers level twenty four. 
you consider this a victory? It's a fantasy gem was worth. Just like the rest of this world. Go ahead. Tend to defeat me. You can do it again. And again. <laughs> and again. Each time I'll just come back. The next time you see me, my form will have changed. But I'll just be stronger. You think you've won, Jimsworth? But there's no end to me. You know, I'm starting to think because he's got like a brain thing going on. Mm -hmm. That my previous theory that we're like in some sort of coma or something, we're fighting brain cancer. That that's my card theory. Multi Woo, give me a second. All that sitting on the throne is doing my simony good. Uh, keep it together, King. This is a very royal of you. Now, so Jimmy the Horde Ghoul, as King of Highland, is my duty to humbly apologize. We are going to detain you, but all of a sudden I came to my senses. Not sure how the Chancellor was doing it, but I'm sure that he was controlling me. The commands have faded, but I can still hear them echoing in my mind. Jimmy is the enemy. Kill him. Snuff him out. How awful. Kingland is a peaceful country, and Jimmy, well, you're just really a good person. That's clear to me now. Kingland, no, all of Everchip owes you a great debt of gratitude. I know you must continue your journey, but if you have a moment, you're always welcome in Kingland. Come along, man. We've showed these heroes. We've slowed these heroes down long enough. But you have seven of the eight objects. Yeah, go there. That's okay. Go there. I thought the eighth one would have been there. It's like the average chip. Hmm. Not yet. Well, where is the um the thing that you got? Which one was it? Was it uh, south? It was uh, east. east. Yeah. So if we have seven of eight, then we can deduce the last one wherever That's it exactly might be. That's what I was thinking. Mega Man. It's in this area. That was the right spot, unless. Minor detour. Yeah. Uh, you, you, again, I'm just saying, you can always go look at the dark dungeon. That doesn't mean you're going into it. You can observe it. Okay. All right. So Let let's see. Uh, look one this is up. this one. I don't have two is the triangle. Three is this one. Or is this one? Five is the one I'm missing. That one is I kind think of hard it's off this camp. one. Pretty sure it's this one. Are you asking for a confirmation or are you just going to test it? No, I'm speaking out loud. Okay. Six. Six is. I remember you circle. were saying it was hard to draw. Seven is the square. And eight is the cross. You did it. Fountain. Wizard's robe. A wizard robe? 
Ooh. Magic defense go up. More importantly, MP return. Oh. So, I, I know you like Mage Jimmy, but, uh... There will be somebody much better to put that on. Hashtag soon. But now... Let's put the bust on. Jimothy. Because I got MP regen, so I can just combust more often. I'm an AoE attack. Let's check out that fountain too, shall we? Word. It's a flower game. Not monster set. You didn't steal it. Rare set. Is that the attack? Yep, roast. Or agility. Mm hmm. Give it the attack. Welcome to the Dark Dungeon. Need some more information on the Dark Dungeon? Oh, finally knew someone interested in explaining things. Oh, wait, that's me. What would you like to know? Unique item list. Oh. And it's a unique item that you can find somewhere in one of those items. And it is. So is this a Lufia 2 callback? A bit. You find you can only find each unique item one time. Afterwards, you only find points in toy boxes. Well, unless it's a mimic. As you progress to the dark dungeon, you'll find dungeon points. You get most of these from point space. You also find them in some toy box spaces. Dungeon points are banked when you leave the dungeon. No one can take those points from you. However, if you die in the dungeon, while you won't lose any items you found, you will lose all of your unbanked dungeon points. You can use any dungeon points you've earned to buy things from Chuff. You might also run into Rubik as an engine who will sometimes offer you special deals in return for a percentage of your unbanked points. While he doesn't offer items, he can help out a lot. Dark dungeon can be quite handful. Luckily, there are lots of items to make it easier. Here's what they do. Pocket Louder lets you leave the dungeon. Trap Detector allows you to bad pass spike traps, pitfalls, and mimics. Keys unlock and lock doors. Mulligan Dice lets you roll again. Double, roll a second die. These values are added together. Loaded Dice, select what you roll. You then you only hold nine of each item other than a Pocket Ladder. You can only have one of those at a time. It's... Less rando, more board, board game. Uh, Use a pocket ladder. Rubik sometimes sells it in the dungeon. You can just pay them on item spaces. You'll beat the dungeon. Very difficult. Don't expect it to be a just your beginner. Die. <laughs> Very painful. You should probably avoid this. You also lose any unbanked points and you won't be able to warp back to the new floor you unlock on that run. Alright, if you use a pocket ladder to escape, next time you enter the dungeon, you'll be able to warp back to the floor you left off on. Well, the closest is divisible by 10. So pretty oh, good! Uh, if I take a trip down Dark Dungeon, bring back some Dark Points, I'll hook you up. So. I have nuked. Lies leave so, a dungeon unlimited uses. That's probably the first thing that you want to go for. Yeah. The VIP pass. Start the dungeon with the key, also good. Start with one type of die. Start with one trap detector. Wow. Right or kick. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yep. No more attack is magical? Cool. Yeah. Instead of running your normal attack off of attack power, it'll run off of your magic power. Are you actually going to poke your head in? See what it is? Alright, 
And this is why I said establish a basic Jimmy. Every floor you start on will randomize what form you're in. And I don't think you can change out. But yeah, you roll the two, one, two. You don't have a key, so you get to force, you don't get to pick your path. You got points. This is weird. It's not like Livia 2. No, it really isn't. It, the only thing in, uh, alike is the 100 floors. Now you fight. Yeah, we can fight these guys. Yeah. I wonder if you can switch. I forget. You can change forms in battle. Just, just check and see if you can change forms. Nope. nope. All right, you're locked in. Noted. That's why you need to always have Jimmy's like things. Yep. That way you can establish a gym. And you can go into battle not like being frankly over optioned and overpowered. Oh my god. <sighs> oh, you must have landed on traps, huh? I landed on a bunch of traps, yeah, but jeez. The... Yeah, and you don't get to go into your menu. You just play the game. Good thing she's fast. Didn't matter. That's kind of unfair. Like, if you think about it, it's kind of unfair. Yeah. But, yeah, that's why it, there's plenty of game and plenty of time to come here, but I did use this to grind to level 99. <laughs> This is so unfair. Come on! those traps that kind of ruined me. Yeah. The traps and bad rolls. And, and it, it ain't too bad to show this off on camera now, but this is kind of the, the kind of thing you want to do off camera when you have free time. If yeah. you really want to get like the overpowered stuff. Yeah, but for the first time, I'm kind of sure. Oh off. yeah, for sure. How far can we go? Come two. on, two. Oh, come, come on, low roll. Stinky. Told you I'm not very lucky. Ugh. 
And now I'm gonna have no HP again. So forest movement tiles. Come on, low. Perfect. Perfect. Now, Horsey is about to hit with a major spell. Oh no, he cured himself. He cured himself before you even touched him. I'm gonna get countered here. Nope, that worked out. So if it was with the traps, I wouldn't be having so much bumps. Right. Yeah. Would be nice if I can get some items here. Yeah, which again, unlucky. Plus, I'm pretty sure it's just easy to do it with more people. So, if I die, I don't lose all my money. I just lose all my points from the dungeon, right? Yes. About to go crazy. Yeah, hit thyself. So the monsters get stronger the deeper I go, or are they based on your current? Uh, the, the, they change per 10 floors, or maybe per 5 floors. They so happen to start at this. Because I'm about to get wrecked if that's true. Because once I got past 10th floor, I think I'm dead. But I got a fountain. Ah. Oh, 
double dice. So you push your other button, I guess you're probably your field action button, it'll bring up your menu. So that just means I move twice, right? Uh, you'll roll two dice. Don't know if I want to go faster right now. Dang it, I Regular hate gym. Can't get levels. You just get exp. Choose your path. Press a direction. I know, I'm thinking. Oh, okay. I think you can, like, scan ahead, right? Ah, oh, welcome to from the next area. They're here. I am screwed. But if you survive, you have an experience advantage. So far, you've run into the easy enemies from the next area. Yeah, I know. That's what worries me. You haven't run into a balanced equation yet. Or a variable fish. Or a red fish. Or a blue fish. <laughs> so that's fine. Aw, oh, come on. Oh, come on. I was like five hit points away from warning that massive shot. I assume the pits make you fall into the next area. Yep, skip that floor. Which can work, can, can work to your advantage if you're trying to reach depths. Say, well, give me the escape item. Oh, I think you can steal the sun's heat. Maybe, but I'm also can just kill it. Well, right. Lars said stop. All this is 25. This points mean nothing unless I can get that escape item. Because if I die, I lose all my points, right? Yep. So I need to find that escape item, otherwise I'm screwed. for you. One of each type of dice. For 10% of your points. So for 11 points. Or a free trap detector. Trap detector is so I don't get hit by a trap, right? Yes, it makes the it makes you immune to spikes one time. How do I use it? It's automatic. Okay. I wish she I wish she sold me stupid escape item. Ah, 
Ah, I don't want to use the item. Dang it. Shoot, I just wasted it. Well, now I know how it works. Yep. Stop giving me Jimmy! No, it won't. It's like third time now. Oh, we got Stronger the enemy. Now. So they power up is what's going on. Pretty much. Seems like these guys have constant AoE, so I don't even think I need to taunt. As soon as I say that, he doesn't do an AoE. That's a rare item. And that stays with me, even if I die, right? Yes. That is yours. You, you come away with a prize. There's that, at least. Oh, let me see how worth it that might be. Oh, that ain't bad. Plus three defense. Oh, that's great. faster I did not first time we've seen this one Escape item, dang it. Oh, come on. Come on. Why is my luck so, so horrible? Everything good. Ah! Oh, look at it's this. It's your favorite form. This game hates me. Two. Hey. Come on, One or two. Low. Yo, two. Nope. We take those. There we go. Ah! Look at the dice. Choose your direct. Choose your. Choose your number. 
So if you're ever that close to an item, you can be like, no, I want to use it now. Yeah, I know. I just keep... I keep rolling sixes, like, non-stop. Bear up. How come I can't select the other dice? Go down? More down? It's not like me. Huh. Maybe you have to roll first. Because you roll and then you add on to it. Oh, yeah. yeah. That's exactly Reroll what happens. Reroll and mulligan. So if I get a bad roll, I could always skip it. Right. Yeah, let's go down. Of course I rolled high. Of course I rolled high. Never fails. Better than spikes. Oh, oh, okay. So, concentric Burton's. Huh? He, concentric burdens. What? Concentric burdens. I have no idea what that means. Oh, that's the enemy's name. So he has. T <laughs> concentric burdens have barriers. Blue is magic, red is physical. You must dispel his barriers before you can get through to him properly. So I had to hit him with the spell? You have to hit him with magic first and then physical. But both, I think they still do damage. But if you hit him with physical first, he will be immune. That counts as physical. Oh no, I counted. Or maybe it's just two barriers. I just know concentric burtons are a pain in the butt. Oh wait, now he's the wrong color, dang it. Yeah, so now you can punch him. He's fine. That's annoying. Yes. He he's he's a, a higher level foe. I'm glad you only had to deal with one of them. Oh guys now 26. I think Yell does more in her 30s. Excellent. Going to the right is, is safe? Yeah. Wish I could get the heck out of here. Physical, I guess. What? Is it two physical barriers? I think you have it backwards. I think red is magical. Alright. Uh, Concentric Burton. No, that's weird. Because it was purple, there was blue, then red. I don't get it.
Give me an escape rope. Give me a providence. <laughs> okay. Yeah, it seems to have two physical barriers. Okay, yes. Each time Concentric Burton is attacked, it will lose one ring but take no damage. Both rings are lost, it turns back into regular. Come on, give me an item, please. Oh, uh, lots of crime, please. Lots of crime and lots of counters. You're stealing the edge off of a pentagon. You've reduced his size. All right, you can only crime once. Oof. Attack the appropriate number of times. Yeah, that hurt. Yeah. Shapes suck. Ooh, the one fish and two fish. But they are also red fish and blue fish. Yeah, this looks like an annoying fight too. It, one likes punching and two likes likes. Yeah. So that tells you how the berries work. The blue fish reflected the magic. But how do I hit the right guy? With magic. going on here? This is ridiculous. This is the dumbest fight ever. I, I can't win this fight because these redfish, bluefish are impossible to deal with. Alright, well this ends my run. Fortunately, I got killed by some BS game mechanic. I didn't get killed because I was weaker. Then the enemy I got killed because I couldn't hurt an enemy. And that was lame. Yeah, bet. But we do keep our money. And you do keep that, uh, the, 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 the Stonehenge Moe statue, whatever you got. Yeah, I need to come back here when I have a character who can deal single target magic damage and, you know, full party maybe. Yep. Yep, that's why I just like you poke your head at what it is. So progress is that weird space down there where the dragon is. What about that castle? Sure doesn't look like there's a way to walk over there yet.
Oh, another pod. Hmm? This is the sacred lantern. Are you really that lost boy? Come to the right place, I suppose. This boy lost find the way. Don't be distressed. We all get lost. Go find your path. Shiny knives is here. Hey! It's Love lobster! Dad! Cuddlefish. Is it? Is it really you? Aww. I missed you more than ice cream. I miss you more than video shows. Damn. Uh, uh, <clears throat> oh, Brussels sprout, Jimmy and I found Lars. Isn't that wonderful? Mm. Uh, yes, of course, Slammer B. Uh, when I crashed here, I coupled together a mixture of wind electrics and determined my position. I was afraid you would never make it here. But here you are. This land is called the Sacred Meridian. It's a continent that floats high above the clouds. There are many mysteries riding, resting here, and knowledge beyond our comprehension. The truth is, I haven't just been waiting here, I've been quite busy. Jimmy, I've been thinking long and hard about the first warning sign. The bees. You've seen it since then, haven't you? The pulsating mass. I've read all about it. What it's capable of. Jimmy, the world is in danger. Before we leave Sacred Lantern, we need to enter the Temple of Sight. There are things you must see there. You won't find all the answers, but it's the first step. Lars. Hmm. Hey. Jimmy, I trust that you kept up with your studies. Ah! New character. The devil the mostly spells makes you imagine long dead civilizations and new only. So he's a spell cast with a lot of MP. Hmm. Come on, when he's selling used cars, will teach at the college level and new only. Winter. No, 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 no. No, no, no. That's the one. Move faster? It's not. Wouldn't the hermit cra crab shell be better on Lars? Not really. Oh, I didn't know his magic defense fell that far down. Agility. Spectacle. Annuals. Black Spiral is good. First Aid is good. Erudite. Most of your book prints on books. That's okay. Oh, he already has base MP regen. Yes. He so just he doesn't gets need his... this. But it stacks. I know, but I can always use magic with Jimmy. Also true. Wanted to let you know, it stacks. Oh, we'll see how our MP uh, goes with the two of them. If I need to give him that extra MP, I'll give him the extra MP. Uh, 250% magic damage, 600 over six turns. Uh, next physical or magic lit will do triple damage. Oh, he also has focus. Oh, focus is uh is is killer, very killer. Yeah, I know my ghost has it. Oh yeah. Oh um, I mean analysis. That's the monster move. Double damage to the next thing you hit, or maybe it did like five times. Damage. I don't know. It's ridiculous. Found the boss out here, but it's no good. He still doesn't recognize us, man. I'm gonna reach out and shake him. It's been years since I was a low level goon. I wouldn't want to stab him accidentally. 
Large finances. As large as I want. Now, did you know there are 397 ways to stab a person? It's something to think about. It's tough. Nunchaku. Oh, yes, 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 yes. Thermal bomb. Thermal bomb. I don't want to spend anything right now, though, because like I said, I, I really want to try to build up my magic reserves. I mean, my money reserves. Your large finances. Because I keep having problems with money. Deposit. There you go. Oh, yes. Thermodynamics. Dad doesn't need healing. Dad needs fire. Leave me alone, kid. I'm tired of dealing with you. Draw energy from the earth. Release it through your kick. The grass is strong. Please draw energy from the earth. This is the temple of the inward looking eye. Eight teachings along already, but one forward seven left sacred land. We can't become without them. I'm sorry, I can't move this spot until everyone arrives. And then now you've got more people to find. You know, I've been thinking. My whole life, I've always been the tough guy. But I guess it's easy to be a tough guy when you're as big as me. But, I don't know, I feel like I'm more than that, and no one ever gets to see the rest of me. They even call me Big Enormous. Not even my real name. It's Norman. What decision made I've liked to be like I am, to be Big Enormous? What if they were to just fit in? Like, what if my identity just reinforces negative behaviors like my tendency to overeat? You, you get what I'm saying? What if I have to overeat or else I won't be big and enormous anymore? Man, being here is really opening up my eyes. What are you picking on me for? Maybe you the real bully. Maybe you should be doing a little introspection yourself. Your master Andrew Spartan, yes? If you only had him for a short while, he must have given you so much knowledge. Master Andrew didn't teach you that, did he? If only I had Andrew back when I went to the Dark Depths before, it would have been better. <laughs> so, yep. um, pretty high up, huh? Maybe it's so surprised you, but little mice like me aren't the biggest fans of heights. But hey, if this is where my journey took me, that's where I am. How did I get up here? I hit a Mr. Tanaka's hair. How did he get up here? I don't know. My eyes were closed all the time. This is a temple of sight. Inside, you will find secrets to pass you long detected. Beware. Monsters are in the halls. Oh, is it a game? I'm sorry, but games are very interesting to me. Wouldn't you like find learning more fun? So I guess you gotta oh. go in there before we could continue. Right. But you can also talk to number two up there, and also... Uh, it's you. Thanks for beating me up back in the arena. Made me realize and figure out some things. Uh, you know, who I really am. I'm gonna go in a change discovery suit. Pretty cool, right? Put See, there's a place as all the world's knowledge. I bet if I find that, I can find out who I am. Sorry, kid. I'm afraid it's over. Can't talk to this guy over here. Yeah, you can. Burbs. Feel the water. Call me mind. One day you could reach enlightenment. There's a cave behind him, but I can't get there. Nope. Maybe if uh, there were a meeting that was called, he would get out of the way. All right. Thank you for watching this video. Feel free to comment on what you saw and what you'd like to see next. I always love to hear your thoughts. But before we go, please remember, 
that you matter and you are brilliant and you are loved and you should always be true to yourself. Never let the world tell you any different. Much love to you from your friendly, feathered, flightless bird.